Hello, I'm Jacob Chick, and this is Two Birds, One Stone. I'm joined by Jamie Chick to talk all things pigeon racing. How did you get into pigeon racing? Um, when I was eight years old, I seen my first pigeon on the roof. I called it down and, and it came in the shed and started from there. <laughs> so a good, a good long time there. So how long have you been in pigeon racing for roughly, would you say? Um, 40 years. 40 years. And you've got a partner as well. How long has that been? Has that been a thing 21. as well? 21. And then um, what was life like before, as a kid growing up with sports? How was you doing pigeon racing now? Or did you do any other sports when you were younger? Just play a bit of football. And then how would you say pigeon racing works for people who have no idea on the sport at all? Well, we just exercising daily. Then when it comes to racing, which we don't start until April. So you start training two weeks before the first race. Put them in a basket, drive them to 20 miles from home, release them, and then someone, will, my partner, will call them in on their return. So they'll beat you home. Yeah. <laughs> so they're quite they'll fast then. Me. Yeah, they'll beat me home, and we do that about ten times. And they done an exercise every day as well. They should be fit enough for the first race. Sounds good. At the end of the season, is there rewards? Is there how many people do you see often? Right, just, in your own league. just your club members, but um, best bird on the day who wins the race. Fair I've won a few of my time. I've been highest prize winner three or four years running. I've been won positions, high positions in nationals, top the federations. One o'clock. <laughs> Sounds like a good prize to win by the end of the season. So. Is there anything else you do like before the season starts? Do you do any other sort of pigeon competitions? I know there's. No, we used to have shows, but they people don't show no more. They don't. They don't bother. You say pigeon racing is slowly fading away now from from culture. It is. It is from our our area. So we up in England is still thriving. There we go. Is there anyone like any big names you could suggest of pigeon racers that you know of or? Did you ever look up to someone who was pigeon racing? Yeah, there was one or two in the club. So it was mainly just local people who you'd seen do it before and yeah. you've carried on from there? Yeah. Well, thank you for your time.